it's actually almost six months now that we've been here. We want to come home. Freedom is priceless. We take it for granted. It was an average boring day. I was an ordinary guy. I was the CEO of Coca-Cola Brazil. None of us knew the dangers we were going to face. In the Philippines. Transport American. Eight prison guards. Held hostage. By Somali pirates. Oh my God, I'm being kidnapped. The ransom demand was million. seven million dollars. Our kidnappers are losing patience. That could be me. That could be my son, my daughter. The stakes are way up here. Não pagar, você paga com a vida. He said, tell the children I love them. Either we're going to get them, please, or they're going to die. Hey, Bali here. So did you like that video? Do you think the movie will be a success? Well, if not, maybe it will join the list of biggest box office bombs, which is what I'm here to talk to you about today, with a list of movies from this category. So let's start off with 2009's The Lonely Bones, which bombed at the box office with an estimated $64 million loss. Titan AE from 2000, which had an estimated loss of $137 million. 2015's Tomorrowland, starring George Clooney, recorded an estimated $76 million loss at the box office. The 13th Warrior, starring Antonio Banderas, had a loss of $98 million. Disney's animated Treasure Planet from 2002 lost a whopping $112 million. The Adventures of Baron Munchausen, starring John Neville, lost more than $77 million. The Lone Ranger, starring Johnny Depp, lost $97 million. Guy Ritchie's The Man from Uncle lost $80 million at the box office. The infamous John Carter lost $126 million. And lastly, Hugo by Martin Scorsese lost $60 million. Whoa. So, do you agree with the movies of this list? Let me know in the comments below and remember to subscribe to our channel for all the best trailer releases. See ya!